It's been three years since we said goodbye to the Gallaghers after watching the family be everything from hilarious to totally cringeworthy. We saw so many of the cast grow up right before our eyes. It's kind of hard to imagine them in other roles now. But actually, a bunch of the former Gallagher clan are pretty hot commodities in Hollywood these days. In fact, you might not even recognize some of them anymore. I get the feeling you think you're smarter than me. Ready to see what they've been up to? Let's go. William H. Macy as Frank Gallagher. For 11 seasons, Macy played one of the worst fathers in TV history. Even his final words to his family were brutally critical. I know some of you think you hate my guts. And truth be told, I never liked any of you much either. But despite that, fans couldn't help but love him. So it's no surprise that since putting down his beer glass and leaving the show, William H. Macy has landed even more popular roles. He played Richard in Hulu's The Dropout, alongside Amanda Seyfried. He also gave rom-coms a shot in 2023's Maybe I Do, where his love interest was none other than screen legend Diane Keaton. Well, are you sure? Most recently, you might have seen him in Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. Off-screen, the 74-year-old is already working on his legacy through his kids. Macy's oldest daughter, Sophia, just made her acting debut in The Twilight Zone. Looks like we'll be seeing more from the family in the years to come. Emma Kenny as Debbie Gallagher. Debbie had one of the wildest storylines, going from a scrappy little tomboy to a hustling teen mom. Emma Kenny has really done it all. She once told the New York Post, I really want to dabble in a million different worlds, different genres, time periods, characters, locations. And honestly, the 25-year-old is already on her way to doing just that. Since then, she's lent her voice to the animated film My Love Affair with Marriage, alongside her former on-screen brother, Cameron Monaghan. These days, after appearing in Roseanne, she snagged a leading role in its spin-off, The Connors. You might have also spotted her in Back to Lila and Murder at Yellowstone City. One thing's for sure, this girl is busy, but she still makes time for her other passion, animal welfare. Emma is a proud dog mom and a big advocate for pet adoption. Opening up your life to a dog who needs a home is one of the most fulfilling things you can do. She even told Us Weekly that if she weren't an actress, she'd be a vet. Guess it's all about balance. Cameron Monaghan as Ian Gallagher. Just because his role as Ian is over doesn't mean Cameron has been taking it easy. Since leaving the show, he's appeared in Shattered Opposite John Malkovich, and he also had a role in Paradise Highway. You probably recognize him from Gotham, where he played the Valeska twins, who were basically precursors to the Joker. I've been waiting for this moment for 15 years. But the 31-year-old hasn't just been in front of the camera. Along with lending his voice to several Star Wars video games, he's also written, directed, and starred in a short film called Fox Body, set to release in 2025. Who knows? This could be the start of a whole new career pivot. Emmy Rossum as Fiona Gallagher. While she was on the show, Emmy Rossum seemed a little too much like her character. In fact, after she left in 2018, the rest of the cast found the set to be a much more positive environment. Emma Kenny even spilled the beans after Emmy's departure, saying, Yeah, no, it was, it, was, it was weird at first, for sure, but it also, the set became a little bit more of a positive place, I'm not gonna lie. That said, Emmy's put her energy into some exciting new projects. She took on the starring role in Peacock's Angeline in 2022, where she completely transformed her look. I'm actually... She also scored a role in Apple TV Plus's The Crowded Room, a limited series with Tom Holland and Amanda Seyfried. On the personal side, the 38-year-old has been just as busy. Since marrying her second husband, Mr. Robot showrunner Sam Esmail, in 2017, Emmy has become a mom, twice. But enough about Emmy, Let's get back to the rest of the cast. Ethan Kutkoski as Carl Gallagher. Since wrapping up his role as Carl, Ethan has stepped back from the spotlight a bit, but not completely. He starred in the film Alex October the year after Shameless ended and even reunited with some of his Shameless castmates for an episode of The Connors. More recently, we saw him in the 2023 film Going Places. So, what's been keeping him busy all this time? His music career. Ethan's been a huge music fan since he was a kid. And that hasn't changed. 
In 2021, he dropped a single called Erase Me, followed by Anyway, two years later. But maybe the most surprising thing is that he's also launched a fashion label called Chaotic Collective, where he lets his creativity run wild, blending music with fashion. We're gonna shoot a commercial for his clothing brand and also some music video content. Now for a little detour from the Gallagher family. Well, kinda. Noel Fisher as Mickey Milkovich. Mickey might have only been a half Gallagher by marriage, but off screen, Noel Fisher definitely followed in the family's footsteps. He too made an appearance on The Connors, starred in the 2020 film Capone, and popped up in a few episodes of The Calling. Soon, we'll see him back on the big screen. Earlier this year, Noel was cast in an upcoming AI thriller called Cognitive. Off screen, the 40 year old is happily married to fellow Canadian actress Leila Alizada. And in case you needed proof that Noel's nothing like his shameless character, here's a fun fact. He occasionally posts book reviews on his Instagram to encourage his fans to read. Who knew he had so many surprises up his sleeve? Shinola Hampton as Veronica Fisher. Shinola has been super busy since leaving Shameless. In 2023, she became the lead star and a producer of the NBC drama Found. In the show, she plays a public relations specialist who tracks down missing people. The second season of her new gig is set to drop by the end of 2024. This means Shinola is not just an actress, but also a producer and director. After all, she directed season 11, episode eight of Shameless. Well, usually they give first time directors scripts that have are a little diluted. Mine was not. <laughs> <laughs> and let's not forget Influencer. If her ad for TJ Maxx is any indication, she's definitely adding that to her resume. Hi everyone, it's Shinola. This is a Get Ready With Me TJ Maxx edition. All this while being a wife to actor Darren Dukes and mom to two adorable kids. But what about her on-screen boo? Steve Howey as Kevin Ball. Like his former on-screen wife, Steve Howey hasn't been resting on his laurels. Since saying goodbye to Kevin Ball, he appeared in Netflix's vampire film Day Shift, alongside Jamie Foxx and Dave Franco. What's the garlic for? Any event gets close to me, I spit in their eye. Clearly, he's a fan of action roles because after that, he took on the part of Harry Tasker in True Lies. This series is a reboot of the 1994 film featuring Arnold Schwarzenegger and Jamie Lee Curtis. When he's not flexing those biceps, Steve is a dad of three and co-parents with his ex-wife. Later this year, he's set to appear as a guest star in Brilliant Minds. And after that, who knows? Watch this space. And now, for the cast's biggest overachiever. Jeremy Allen White as Lip Gallagher. His character might have been a brilliant genius, but it seems like he's got nothing on the actor who played him. While Lip let opportunity slip through his fingers, Jeremy Allen White has done the complete opposite. This guy seems to be everywhere. As soon as Shameless wrapped, he appeared in the film The Birthday Cake, starring Val Kilmer. That was followed by the short film Cornflower and Apple TV's Fingernails which offers a really unique take on romance and love. But aside from all that, White is probably best known for his current role as Chicago-based chef Carmi in The Bear. And let me tell you, that show is brilliant. I can sense the sarcasm. No, 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 not sarcasm. Not only has The Bear earned Jeremy a Golden Globe, a SAG Award, and a Critics' Choice Award, but he's also snagged two Emmys for the show. And that's not all. He's beefed up to star alongside Zac Efron in The Iron Claw, which tells the story of a family of professional wrestlers. There's more. As popular as White is for his roles, he's made just as many headlines about his personal life. First up, there's his 2023 divorce from his wife and baby mama. He and actress Addison Timlin co-parent two daughters, Ezer and Dolores. You look like a dad. Huh? He is a dad. <laughs> The second reason for his current popularity, he bared it all for a Calvin Klein ad. And with that, you're all caught up with the cast of Shameless and their latest projects. Hi, Shameless fans. Thanks for watching. Thank you. <laughs> of course, if you're feeling a bit nostalgic and want to see more, be sure to check out our other videos about the cast and the show.